I'll need to move carefully. If I can count on anything, Damien will be working in an angle. He's got another agenda. Okay, right now I need that briefcase. The boss wanted me to explain just how important this is. You're not just carrying a case of names and invites. You're carrying the future of our business. Background checks, indiscretions, tendencies, everything Quinn needs to keep his guests loyal. Got it? Now pretend this thing is full of solid fucking gold bricks. I do, it's moving. Wait, I can't believe it. What? Quinn's guys are pulling some old school gangster shit. A briefcase swap. Really? Do those actually work? Never seen one of these. Why are they doing this? Did they fool CTOS? Anybody watching through a monitor would see every swap. They're trying to confuse the detection software. Interesting. They got the case on a boat heading upriver. They got a bike here. I'm gonna follow. Maybe I can see where they're going. Give me a sec. What do you have nearby? My guess, this will be a short trip. There's another drop for another pickup. Okay. Oh, nope. Nope. Wait. There's an old marina bought by Lucky Quinn in 1967. That's gotta be it. Says it's been closed to the public since the 80s.
Sending the guest list from the case. Whatever this auction is, the club's not taking chances. Security will be tight. Okay, so we'll find you a suitable identity. Not a regular. Someone from out of the country. A guy they won't recognize. I'll let okay. him take you off. Okay. This one. Can you pull off a Mr. Pang? I don't think so. Any Europeans? Nicholas Crispin. 32 years old. Expat American. Hasn't been back in 12 years. That's the one. Oh my god. Realistic preferences. Man, is sick. And filthy rich, too. Will anyone miss him? What do you mean, miss him? Clara, if I'm stealing his identity, I can't have him around blowing my cover. I can't keep him alive. Oh. No, I guess not. My sister's missing, Clara. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get her. Listen, if this is too much for you, you can walk away. I'll understand. No, I'm fine. Nobody's going to miss this dog. This is a good match. He's supposed to pick up his car at the dealership. All right, I'll meet him there. This auto shop's a mad mile. Yeah, I'm gonna need to hack the district control center first.
Access, beat it. What is that? Shit!
Hey! Yeah, looky, looky! Check my cookie! Woo! I'm about to take off, ladies! Yeah! Oh, oh, oh! Who's got... How much of this data is CTOS collecting? Where's it stored? What are they doing with this? What about... Um, hey, you. Uh, I'm gonna kiss you. Got it. Now, Nicholas Crispin. Get lost. Hi, this is Aiden, Jack's uncle. I want to make sure things are going okay there. First, I want to know if things are okay with Nikki. We haven't heard from her. She's still working things out. She just needs a little more time. Well, Jackson misses her terribly. She should at least give him a call. I can tell he's restless. He's not happy here. I understand. And I'll let her know. You have any problems with Jax, anything at all, if he wanders off or anything, you call me right away. I will. You take care of that sister of yours. Yeah. I am. shows that people are rallying on the side of vigilante suspect Aiden Pierce. People are even offering to protect Pierce. However, Chicago PD warns that doing so could lead to criminal charges. Whoa! <laughs> 